she's 5'8", and a large woman. What happens in these situations, I might be wrong. What happens in these situations is that oftentimes these women with these insecurities, right, when they find other people's insecurities, they often go in on those insecurities. I could be wrong, but let's watch. Let's see what happens. Mm -hmm. I prefer tall men. Okay. I can't see myself with a short man. So like, niggas ain't shit. Okay. <laughs> Man, that shit got to do with your height. Well, yeah, yeah. I agree. I don't know. I don't care what you say. After we'll I continue. Okay, okay. So I'd rather have my heart broken by a tall man than a short man. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Guys, y'all looking at the thumbnail, y'all looking at the title of the video, y'all already know what time it is. It is time to get active. Shout out to my Instagram at the real MTR. I call it out because this content comes directly from my IG. Go up there and follow your boy. Link down in the description box down below. Shout out to the daily wrap-up crew. Young scholars are hitting it over there. All right. They just uploaded a video sent to me. Entitled Most Women Find Short Men Undateable. We need to go over this conversation. Without further ado. Real quick. Hey, you funny and all, but like, you a midget. I can't do it. Damn. Right, baby, it's the height, but we can be friends. We can, you know, we can kick it, you know. You already know what I just said. You know, y'all have to pass I'm sorry, but you know, you know, <laughs> pass. I almost feel bad. I'm past. <laughs> Yo. Shout out to this young scholar right here. Here's the thing. You can't change anything about your height. Like, it's just the way that you were born. You know, you got that random um, unluck of the draw from a height perspective. And there's nothing that he can do in order to change that. What well, my issue is, is how they just destroy him in front of millions like that. Like, pretend it was you. Women want to talk all day that they have all the, you know, why can't men be emotional? And then we look at the way that y'all treat some of us. It's absolutely absurd and it's absolutely ridiculous. Shout out to that brother right there. Damn. Why is that funny? I'm just no. embarrassing, actually. I, I find this topic interesting because usually when men have preferences, it's looked at as shaming, like, you know what I mean? Like, but when women have preferences, it's funny. It's funny. Yeah. Like, laughing, it's looked at as it's not taken seriously. Look at them all giggling like, and you know shit. I mean? So, I, what do y'all think about this topic? Like, because if that was in line, if that, if that was a line full of... Yo, if that was a line full of all... Hold up. They're not over here laughing at the man's height. And they got on double XL bubble jackets. Yo, this world that we live in. You don't know you have a lot to say like this. She, she already said she passing on the show, nigga. Right? Like, no, me personally, yeah, yeah, me personally, yo, yeah, yeah. I'm tall. Mm. I'm like almost six feet. Come to the mic. Come to the mic. I'm almost six feet, so mm. I cannot... I don't know. I don't see myself yeah. dating somebody that I could look down on. I get that. Like somebody that was Amina's height, for example. I don't think I, I get, could date anybody. That's just my preference, though. That I get a preference. doesn't have anything against you or you're less of a person or anything like that. Like, she was doing too much. Laughing, I keep keying. That was too much. Okay. But, but, but y'all were too. The same Kiki y'all doing? Facts. I want, I want to no, make no, a point. No, we still feel bad for him. Well, I want yeah. to, I want, I'm going to make That's a point, but what do you got to say about this topic? Me personally, I don't care about height. Like, but I'm lying. lying. I mean, she I'm really lying. short though. Yeah, I know. She's but a guy's short. Short. Yeah, yeah, not like, but I'm question. talking to guys my height. I really, really do not care about height. But like, if you're shorter than me, I don't know. You, you met guys that shorter than me? No, my height. Like oh, five, okay. five, four. Okay. Five, five. I'm about your height. Aren't you five two? I'm five two. Oh, okay. But oh. I have not met somebody shorter than me. But I really. I, if he was shorter than me, that's that, why you don't care. That's, that's why I said you're already yeah, short. So yeah, like, like, yeah. Well, God, yeah, it's not be like it's never yeah. been a problem yeah. for me. Height has never yeah. been a problem. I, like, I told you, I'm five six, but people five, think six, I'm okay. like five eleven. So I'm, I'm I'm five six, but okay. I'm definitely not dating anybody <laughs> shorter than me. My height, I tried that before. I just don't feel like I feel like I could slap you. I'm sorry, that's just the honest truth. Like you're so close. What you said? Like, I don't like that. I want some type. I want to look up to you a little bit. Yeah, at least a little bit. Yeah. I'm sorry. And, and how tall are you? Let's talk about that for a quick second. 
I feel like I could just slap you. The beauty of having podcasts like this is that you take the conversations that are generally in their echo chambers that they all laugh and kiki about, and you bring it over here, and you find that they spout the same shit that was in their echo chambers. How dare you like make an assertion like that? What if I said that, you know, I only like to date women that are littler than me because, you know, I feel like I can slap them at a, no at a moment's notice. How should that be taken? This is where the double standards just, they get highlighted so much. Right. And conversations like this where people are just being honest and you get to call it out. But y'all are the victims, though. Oh, OK. Got it. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> what, what patriarchy would allow women to talk to the patriarchs like this? If it really does exist, what patriarchy would allow this? I'm like 5'11". But I feel like also like uh -oh, who what said, you feel like? like guys have to be shorter like like you know what i mean like you mean why taller that, where did that come from? you mean taller like, society. like taller yeah that's what i'm saying society, society. society. like where did this come from like why it come, does he it have come to from be... the man being able to protect his woman they saying the shorter i guess man can't i can see woman, what you mean I, I think it's more i think it's also like an evolutionary biology need anyway let's let's keep on going in actually like you know stronger and bigger so mm. i think that's why some men are just you know strong taller. Men are but strong. some men probably get their mom's jeans or something mm -hmm. strong men are strong well, I'm saying, yeah, no, a, 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 a five, a five four person could still flip. Mm -hmm. I mean, six two yeah. person. Yeah. Yeah. Can I say this? If I talk to you and you're my height, like your personality has to be like off the wall, like amazing. Like you have to be like the best vibe, the best everything. Like, I have to really like, like be like in love with you. Like you have to make me fall in love with you. Like to be in a relationship. But are you? So are you? Speak next to you and be foot to foot and everything. Like, are you? Ever, are you yeah. even gonna give him a chance to do that though? Yeah, you probably already, he did it before, though, right? He, he did it before, you said. So. Yeah, but she said she's not, doing, not it doing it again. Why not, <laughs> exactly. Why not? So, I so how okay, can a... So, the, 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 the I don't want to do it ever. I don't want to... Don't so, say never. So how can I'm a sorry, person... Like so how can a person that's, be that's your height even get that chance then? Like... You shouldn't be trying to get that chance. Why not? You should be trying to talk to somebody lower, shorter than you or your height. Why? Just, Yo, let me just comment on this because I know all of my average height brothers out there, you're probably up in arms right now. I do understand that like, if you are height challenged, there's other things that you can work on within yourself, your aura, your personality, your game, right? Your mouthpiece in order to get the things that you want. Some of the most, if you want to say the word alpha in this situation, dudes that I've ever met were not like ab above six foot tall. And earned and garnered the respect and you know often dated women that were taller than them as well yes women have height preferences just the same way we have preferences as well but don't let it deter you you know what i'm saying don't let it deter you don't let the laughs and the key king take you away from who you are as a man and your masculinity all right let's just keep going real quick that's, that's fair that's fair I want, i'm gonna bring you back full circle what you got to say about you i got something to say i got a lot to say actually okay. oh god <laughs> i'm five eight. Oh god she's five eight and a large woman. What happens in these situations, I might be wrong. What happens in these situations is that oftentimes these women with these insecurities, right? When they find other people's insecurities, they often go in on those insecurities. I could be wrong, but let's watch. Let's see what happens. Mm -hmm. I prefer yeah. tall men. Okay. I can't see myself with a short man. So like, niggas ain't shit. Okay. <laughs> Damn, that shit got to do with your height. Well, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I agree. I don't know. I don't care what you say. After okay, I agree. Okay, so I'd rather have my heart broken by a tall man than a short man. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Ooh. Where are you going? Go. I should keep going. Keep this, going. This, yeah. Uh, he got to take time to process. Yeah. Keep going. Let keep me going. tell you why. <laughs> you know how disrespectful that is to have your heart broken by a short man, and that's. Like, I knew she was you're not that. my type. Like, you're not even my type to begin with. You know what I mean? I don't, but keep going. I'm gonna let you get your. I'm gonna let you get this off your chest. Like, you know what I mean? Like, why his face like that? I want him to say something. Like you look like you about to. No, I'm just, I just don't understand. Like, I I, I want to bring this back full circle. You guys. I wanna, I'm gonna bring this back yeah, full circle. Sure. If that sure. line was women full of um, plus size women, and guy was guys was going back. No, let me finish. It was there was skinny, the slimmer women, and there was bigger plus size women in that line. And he was going past saying next to all the plus size women. 
y'all gonna say you must hate your mother, you must hate women, you must. No, no, no. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Y'all know, be uh, y'all be killing men when they got preferences, but y'all when y'all when women got. Not other women, but I'm speaking for myself. I wouldn't. I wouldn't have. That's but that's that's completely like crazy. Like you saying every woman, like you're you're saying most women. He's generalizing. Only like thin women. They can only like thick women. That's a preference. You can only like light skin women. Okay, cool. Just don't talk so bad. When, so now when you in the line again, and now you got a hundred kids, and I'm like, you know what? I don't want to date a woman with kids. You hate your mother. You hate. You don't act like oh, women don't do that. it. That's, I'm not you. Oh, that's that's a woman. You. I never heard that. You never heard. That. I heard that shit all, all over the place. I, I hate because somebody no. I yeah, I hear that all. Y'all, y'all on social media? Mm hmm. Yeah, we on social media. I never heard that. That was it? I, so I had to pause it real quick in order to try to collect my thoughts and shit. Um, to hear her say that I would not, I, I can't date another short guy or a person that's shorter than me because it's more disrespectful because I, you weren't my preference anyway. What she doesn't understand is that half of the US male population is around 5'9 or something like that. So she's cutting out 50% of the population just off of the strength of something as petty as that. And it's so ridiculous to me how these women set up these unrealistic standards and expectations. But then when you point around, when you flip around the mirror and you point it at them, they're unwilling to make changes to themselves that make them even appropriate for the upper half or the upper limit of men anyway and then they wonder why so many are single unhappy and alone so far into their lives in to the future i'm gonna dub this the single ass aunties epidemic it starts young let's keep going which one? Again? Instagram. Yeah, which one? Either, either or. Or if he was, if that was that a line, if that was a line full of lighter skinned women and darker skinned women, and he ain't, he just said y'all he passed on all the darker skinned women. Y'all gonna say he hate his mother, he hate women. You just clearly said well, that yeah, because we're dark skinned. Uh, to that, so and that's social a, media on social media because yeah, if probably, you say like yeah. you don't want to double, dark double standards, he didn't say anything. All he said was pass. So that had nothing to say. It depends on what he's saying. That's our point. What you say. Like, uh, even so, if you don't break so, it, behind so, it, it's not down. about what, just a yes so, or no. So if he know. said, if he just said no and moved on, that's it. Yeah, but I, you I, talk, some of them talk. talk you talk down on a shorter man. You say you feel like you could, he feel like yo, he don't want a baby mom. Like you talk down on a dark, uh, on a shorter man. You shit it on him. You shit it on. You say you feel like you could slap him around. Yeah, that's a fact. <laughs> see what, but see, but why, but why is that? Why is that funny? Yeah, got you. Yeah. You know what's so funny? It's just like um, damage against men gets laughed at. But then you flip it around and you say, well, what if a guy said that about that? And then it's not a laughing matter, matter at that particular junction. You know, so when we say things like, you know, why is in society men are just kind of viewed as disposable? And then you get conversations like this and you begin to tease out how the societal, the cultural impacts into these young people's mind and how they equate value for men versus women is inherently different. OK, there's nothing equal about that. And conversations like this demonstrate that. I feel like oh, now it's sure, I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying? If you sure, I just feel like, you know, you can't protect me. And I want somebody that Why do you feel me. that way? You also felt about that, about the light skin dudes. I mean, I didn't say that. I said, you I said, used to feel like that. I mean, point. Just, yeah, but I have, I had a light skin boyfriend. But well, why do you feel so. like that? Did, did she say that she felt that because she had a light skin boyfriend that the light skin boyfriend can't protect her? Why? Yeah. You're so little. Like you could be, you know, I just don't, I feel like if a big guy came and slapped my butt, you're going to be mad scared. Like, I think about stuff like that's, that. That's the thing. Nobody's going to do that. Anybody, that's, a taller nigga. Like, but at least I know he have a, a little bit more of a chance. You know, he got something. Got you have get no to chance. The fuck I have out. to jump in for you. Exactly. Like, you do anything, that's my ass too. That's how I feel. Yo, small, shorter I'm dude, sorry, nigga, that's how nigga, I feel. Nigga, 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 so bad. Nigga, nigga, throw down. Yeah, I feel like, yo, 140 pound uh, uh uh five foot eight dude can put the beats on a six foot two 200 pound male if he's trained if he trains that's why i tell y'all all day train y'all bodies train y'all bodies most people out there are not trained at all I'm trying to tell y'all all right let's keep going oh you probably a nice guy but you should, like you you already dis like women like to discontinue men or, or disqualify men based off of genetics like he can't control I don't do his, that, listen, listen, I don't but he can't that. control his height, nor can he control 
y'all be judging niggas off yeah, their dick I size. Say, he say cannot control it. Yes, if I a say man that, says yeah. he doesn't prefer a woman that. with kids, you could a woman could control it. If he says he doesn't prefer a plus size woman, you could control your weight. Like if you don't prefer, uh, prefer you, you to have a, you can control your weight. You can. You, <laughs> you can. Work out. Like yeah. you can work out. Like you could diet this thing. You if he's saying yo, I don't you can't I prefer, control your weight. No, you can't. Oh, no. Yeah, but, eating disorders, though. That's a real thing. That's not a real thing. Yeah, but that's that's not a again, trying to use the outliers in order to prove what's normally true. You can control your weight. <laughs> Yo, what? What earth do we live in? How is this shit is not normal? Yo, having conversations with women, women nowadays, like, I'm just like, yo, my mind is goddamn blown. My mind is goddamn blown. <sighs> Compared to a height, work on, bro. Dick size, you cannot work on. This is tough. If he says, "Yo," if he says, "Yo," your attitude is too crazy. I don't. You can work on your attitude. So men look at things, women that um they can often change. Like women look at things that you can't. You can't change. Like he can't change his height. Like you know. I'm not mad at you though. You just ain't gonna give him a shot. Be a friend. Because they'll hang out. What's wow. the problem? Why are you mad at me? I don't understand. I'm serious. Like, that's now that's disrespectful. Now you don't want to talk to me? Because I'm honest with you. But if I was no. Did you just wrong. use reverse psychology manipulation tactic on niggas? No. Oh, wow. No. Wow. Okay. Um, no. All right, guys. I'm going to pause it right there. I, it's ridiculous how that just turned over towards the end. Listen, guys, you have to get very... Uh, very good at understanding when the shaming, the insults, right, the manipulation tactics, when they're leveraging different things in order to kind of contort things in your mind. Women are just, they're just naturally good at that. Like we're, we're <laughs> right. And it's, it has to do with like how, how uh, deeply intricate their minds just think about things, right? And, and, and honestly, it's, evolu it's through evolutionary biology. Women cannot, on average, beat you up. But what they can use is their words to try to control you. You have to understand that. What, she, what just happened towards the end there demonstrates that appropriately. Last but not least, for all of my height challenge Gs out there, I'm going to continue to fight for y'all. They're not going to continue to disrespect y'all. Not on my watch. All right? Questions, comments, concerns. Y'all already know what to do. Me over to and Reviews at gmail.com. Got a Patreon as well. If you guys want to join my inner circle, my MT Army, there's a link down in the description box down below. Beam up. See everything that's in store. All of the events that we do. It's the best Discord server. It's the best Patreon on this side of YouTube. I guarantee it. Until next time, YouTube.